Citing imminent danger, Cloudflare Flare drops a hate site, Kiwi Farms. We've talked to uh, we talked to uh, Naya Okama uh, Naya Okami on the Transgender Show recently about her efforts towards this. It's great to see that Kiwi Farms has been taken down at least temporarily. What's going on in this story? So Kiwi Farms, as we talked about um, last week, is pretty much a on board it's an online community forum that allows people to ridicule and out and dox lgbtq plus persons especially transgender people they had multiple um categories of mocking transgender women in particular and you know using all kinds of slur and language that was demeaning and belittling because of the work that Kiwi Farms has done in creating this unsafe environment for transgender people, there has been a growing language of violence against persons. And in particular, ever since Marjorie Taylor Greene um, identified Kiwi Farms as the source of her swatting individual, there's been a backlash against the site. The site was temporarily shut down but then Cloudfare, who provided the security for it, said that it would no longer provide security and pulled all of its backing from them. Kiwi Farms then went to a Russian site for security provisions. And after 24 hours, they withdrew their protections. From what I understand, Kiwi Farms is looking to go to the dark web and generate some kind of traffic over on that side but as of right now kiwi farm is not allowed to continue its work on open internet sites right now in fact there is a company or there's a law in australia that is looking to remove its ability to publish any of its material on the internet so this is kind of interesting um Kiwi Farms has been shut down for all practical purposes, but as we watch this and see what happens, we could see them pop up under different forms or um, in places that don't, uh, you know, where the typical laws do not apply. 